Okay, so ano tong binili ko? Kaso yung dalawang yun na gusto ko, it's about 26,000 peso! And nung tumigim ako ng isa, hambesh, ang sarap niya talaga. So welcome to another vlog and in this vlog I am going to share with you my Singapore hauls or I would like to call them my Singa hauls. Yes, pawiti tayo ng konti. Konti lang naman. So, if you want to know what I got from Singapore, at I'm sure excited kayo dito, ayan, then please keep on watching this video. Alright, Beshi, um, lilipat lang ako ah, sa isang para medyo white wall kasi dapat kayo na pa ako magsushoot but nagpa antigen kami tapos late na kami nagising alam mo ang dami lang nangyari so i was hoping to film around 4 hindi nangyari i'm just gonna show lang yung back yung ano <laughs> setup so ayan siya actually marami akong binili pero more on perfumes and food you know food naman as always and surprisingly wala masyadong makeup because sold out lahat ng mga gusto ko and i don't know for some reason i was at the point lang nung nasa singapore ako na parang i don't wanna buy if I don't really, really need it. And kung bibili man ako ng makeup, yung magagamit ko lang. So, yun yung mode ko nung nandun ako, namimili ako sa Sephora. I think it's also because of my experience last year. Sobrang dami ko talagang tinapong cosmetics. As in, sobrang nang hinayang ako. So, for this haul, I just got what I wanted to try and what I need. And yung mga wala, na yung mga wala, Ayun, hindi na lang ako nag-substitute. Normally, I would substitute eh. Kasi, alam mo yun, gusto ko lang may mabili, but now, hindi. Ayun, so, lilipat na ako sa isang ano, white wall para mas maganda naman yung itsura natin. Okay, dito na tayo sa ating white wall. Ayan, mas maliwala. Tignan. So, I would like to start with Bath and Body Works. Kasi ito yung medyo pinakamarami. Ito siya, Bath and Body Works. I actually love Bath and Body Works. Kapag nagkakasyon carry ako, yun yung lagi kong binibili doon. Pero for some reason yun, hindi ko talaga siya makita in the malls near me. Kaya... Lagi siyang out of sight, out of mind sa akin. And when I got to Singapore, yun yung una ko nakita. Sabi ko talaga, okay, bibili talaga ako dito. And I did. And a lot of my pasalubongs I got from Bath & Body Works because I really love the brand, especially the fragrances. Okay, so I'd start with the Bath & Body Works for myself. So, bumili lang ako dun nitong kulong na to kasi naamoy ko to before. And sabi ko, ang bangwa, para siyang blueberry floral tapos very summery yung fragrance ayan actually favorite daw to ni Heart Evangelista ngayon ko lang nalaman habang nagbabrowse ako ng TikTok kanina naamoy ko na to before way way back nung nag cash and carry ako I think that was last year when I was buying um gifts and then sinamahan ko ng body wash because I love body wash I didn't get lotion because um in Manila hindi talaga ako masyado naglo lotion because pawisin ang atin nyo Finally, for myself, ito. So, this is just the Aromatherapy Scented Candle. I've been hearing a lot of good stuff about Bath & Body Works um, scented candles. And that's why, when I got there, I really made it a point to get one. I wanted the big ones. However, ang laki. So, medyo nag-worry ako na mag-overbaggage ako and hindi magkasya. Kasi, it was the, the second day pa lang um, of our Singapore trip. And parang marami rin ako na bili. So, sabi ko, ito na lang. Ah, Ambang, oh my god, it's lavender and cedar wood. Ano siya, lavender powdery na merong hint of wood. I love wood in my fragrance. Yun lang yung binili ko for myself sa Bath and Body Works. And ang dami kasi mga pangpasalubong to. So let's go through them one by one. This is for my um, ate in the house. So this is Secret Wonderland Fragrance Mist. Next is for my sis-in-law. Ayan, so this is Hello Beautiful Fine Fragrance Mist. So yung profiles ito mga fragrances na to, fruity floral and um, aquatic floral. So kung interested lang kayo, magsi Singapore kayo, ayan, hanapin niyo yung mga yan, mabango yan. Next is Into the Night. So this is a very ambery um, floral fragrance, may hint of shea butter. Mabango siya. And this is for my sis in this is for my sis in Loba, tama ba? Basta yung asawa ng kapatid ko, ayun. Basta yun, nakalimutan ko. So um body mist and body wash. Next is for my mommy. And it's um, Cashmere Glow Fine Fragrance Mist. Ang bango rin nito. And of course, sinamahan ko ng lotion because she loves body lotions. Ayan. Pasalubong namin ito ni husband sa kanya. So this is for my um, pamangkin here. Nakatira sa amin. Ayan. Cologne lang yan. That's it for Bath and Body Works. Okay, hindi na ako nagdagdag. Even if I wanted to because... 
ang bigat and natakot ako na baka mag-overbadage ako but when I got to the counter it was only 23 kilograms we flew pal so 30 kilograms yung um, limit ko sayang sana nagdagdag pala ako next is Universal Studio souvenir so itong mga souvenirs na to um, for my mom and also yung mga kamag-anak dito sa bahay so I will start with this one so this is a nice Hello Kitty shirt hindi ko alam bakit may Hello Kitty sa Universal Studios so this is for my sister-in-law the next one is this. Ito, akin naman to. Para may souvenir naman ako. So, this is a yellow minion shirt. Wala. It's a general shirt. Kasi minion, minions yung special nila for this month. And cute ng minions. And I love minions. So, ito na lang yung kinuha ko. Next is Cookie Monster. This is for my mother because she loves Cookie Monster. Ayan, mga pang zumba-zumba niya. Nagsusumba yun lately. And then, next natin is this. This is from... I think this is from Monsters, Inc. Yung Cebu kasi ito ay yung may dala siyang unicorn. Tama ba? Basta ayan. So, ito siya. Yours forever. So, this is for my pamangkin na dito nakatira sa amin. Ito naman kasama ng pabango niya. That's it for Universal Studios. Tapos na tayo. Next are very random souvenirs. So, this one is for my mom's house helper. Yung matagal ng house helper sa amin. So, this is an I Love Singapore canvas bag na may zipper. And the next one, this is just for my ate here. Kasama rin naman to ng pabango niya. So, this is a Singapore shirt. Actually, I wanted to explore Boogies more and mamili ng mas marami pang souvenirs. However, hindi ko na-expect yung dami ng tao. As in, talagang palitan ng mukha levels doon. So, we only went to the stalls in the front and then we left na after getting a few shirts. Okay, so next is this one. So, this is from BHG. This is their department store there. Kung gusto nyo yung mga medyo mura-mura na mga items and mid-priced items like yung mga Bonilla, Michael Kors, yung mga gano'n. Meron dito sa BHG. So, also yung mga um, brands like Adidas, Nike, ano ba ba, Jansport, yun. Doon meron sa BHG department store. Because yung malls like Paragon and Ion, along Orchard and Wisma Atria, they um, have high-end luxury goods. So, kung hindi nyo masyado type yun, and wala kayong budget doon, or meron naman, but you'd rather buy something else, gusto nyo mas marami kayo mabili, then go to um, BHG department store. So, may bugis area lang din to. So, ang pinili ko dun sa mom ko is this one. This is her personal bilin. So, this is the Pro Peds Support Pantyhose. And this is um, in the shade shadow. Ginagamit nito lagi pag nag-office. I remember when I was still young, meron siya mga ganito. <laughs> As in, favorite niya. And I got her like um, eight pieces. I got her five shadow and five na honey. This one. That's it for um for BHG. So, punta naman tayo ngayon sa food. Okay, so dito naman tayo sa food. First is this um, coffee brand na talaga namang binivlog ng mga vloggers sa pumupunta sa Singapore. At talagang binibili nila. And this is the Bacha Coffee. So, this is a brand from Marrakech and it is a pretty expensive brand of coffee. If you're familiar with TWG, yung parang they have selections of teas and you just buy a tea and then take it home. Tapos, they have teas from around the world. This is the same thing but it's coffee. Grabe. Grabe yung presentation, best na nyo naman. Ang ganda. Bumili nga lang kami ng tinapay dito. Ang tindi nung ano yung presentation. Tapos, nung inabotan kami ng resibo, nakaganito pa. Parang, thank you for a, what, $5 croissant? As in, talagang nakaganito. Pero in Philippine peso naman, $5 is 250 pesos. So, ano naman, pwede naman nakagano. Kasi for us Filipinos, medyo high-end na yun for a croissant, no? I got her coffee. Actually, apat yung binili namin. Apat na tag 200 grams. So, in total, we bought 800 grams. But four different flavors. So, for my mom-in-law, um, I got her... Ito, Sao Silvestre Brazil, light medium. Sa daw sa mga masasarap to. And the next one is Blue Danube. This is my favorite because this is um, medium coffee with a berry um, note, undertone. Ang sarap niya talaga, besh. Sobrang perfect. And pag umakain ka rin ng mga ano, um, breads, croissant. It's really good. And then, meron lang sila dito na parang booklet. So, you can get to know the coffees that they're selling. They have these in the store. So, it's like their menu, but you can also take one home. So, ayan. Tapos, ito yung packaging. Inuwi ko talaga yan. Yung dalawa, nandun sa labas. Hindi ko na nakuha before filming. Dito tayo kay Henry Charpentier. So, Henry Charpentier is known for financiers. Parang, na Guinness World Record holder ba sila for like the best tasting financiers. 
And napanood ko yun actually sa vlog ni Vice Ganda when he went to Singapore with Ayon. And sabi ko, hmm, okay, I love financiers kasi Madeline, so mga magkakapareho naman yan. Basta anything na parang light, um, spongy vanilla tasting cake. And grabe, yung financiers. Favorite ko yan. And nung tumigim ako ng isa, hum, besh, ang sarap niya talaga. As in, sobrang buttery, tapos yung almond taste ang sarap. And you'll really know that they used high quality butter. As in, malalasahan mo talaga. Compared to like a cheap Madeline or Financier na you, you just buy somewhere. But anyway, Guinness World Record holders daw sila. So that's why. So, I bought this one. So this is Les Financier by Henry Charpentier. So this is um, a pack of 16. Ayan o, Beshi. Guinness World Record Holder. So, yun. Para sa akin yun and sa mom and loko. So, we'll share here. Next is this one. This is for my mom. So, this is 8 pieces. Ayan. Etong dalawang to, $63 na siya. So, that is about around nearly 3,000 pesos. Ang mahal niya talaga. So, ayun. Hindi na ako bumili because I thought I would buy something when we get to the airport. Pero sobrang naipit ako sa GST refund. So, hindi na ako naka-duty free doon. Had I known, sana, bumili ba ako ng extra box? Kasi ang sarap niya talaga, besh. Okay. And, last but not the least sa food, eto favorite namin to binibili ng mom ko. When, pag nasa Singapore kami, this is Bi Cheng Yang. It's um, grilled pork jerky, then air dry. Tapos, um, they just pack it. And, it, it's cooked on the spot. Yung branch na pinagbilan to nito is at Orchard Road. So, this is very near our hotel. It's actually right beside the Singapore Tourist Center. Basta doon. And Orchard Gateway Mall. Yun. And actually, kung alam niyo yung Emerald Hill, na Instagramable spot, ayun, dun lang siya sa side na yun. May kita niyo agad. It's Bi Cheng Yang and Pork Jerky. Parang meron siyang dalawa na variants. Minced meat and then um, sliced pork jerky. Mas gusto ko yung minced meat kasi it's very chewy and bouncy. Ang sarap nito, just eat it on its own. Or pag morning, palaman nyo lang sa bread. Tapos mag-coffee kayo. Tapos sagyan nyo ng condensed milk. Oh my God! Gutom na ako. Gusto ko na kumain. <laughs> Um, it's $36 for 600 grams and parang nasa 60 plus ba for 1,000 grams, and then 50 plus. I only got 600 grams and I split it into two. One for my mom and one for here sa house. Kasi ang mahal niya. So, yun. Okay, yun na yun. Yung last. And that's all. Charot. Meron pa. I'm sure nakita niyo yung mga malalaki sa likod. Okay, so the last part are my hauls for myself. So, finally, may binili naman ako. Pero still, as always, the bulk of my hauls are for my loved ones. That's really me when I go shopping. Okay, kukunin ko lang yung mga ano, binili ko for myself. Okay, best start tayo dito. So, this is Bayredo. Finally, na-visit ko ng kanilang branch. And I wanted to get um, Baldia Free kasi yun yung HG fragrance ko sa Bayredo. So, my husband got me that. I was thinking of getting a smaller one. Pero, ang mahal niya kasi, it's not the brand wherein you'll buy a bigger one. And if you really like it, you just buy a smaller one for your bag. Because it is really expensive talaga. So, you'll really ponder that 11K. Maybe I should get another fragrance. Not really a small one. Alam mo yun? Because it is already way beyond the threshold of what an acceptable price for a perfume is. At least for me and for a lot of Filipinos. Yung acceptable na price usually sa atin is mga 4 or 5K lang, diba? Beyond that, sobrang luxury na siya. And that is by Redo. So, napaisip ako, yun talaga, what I had in mind was I'll get a smaller Baldia Freak from my bag. And I wanted another fragrance to try. Nabibiling ko na 100ml. Kaso, yung dalawang yun na gusto ko, it's about 26,000 pesos! I like by Redo, pero alam mo yun, hindi talaga ako super duper fragrance person unlike some people I know. It's easy for me to drop that amount on a bag, pero on a perfume, hindi masyado because kanya-kanya talaga tayo. But still, I love perfumes, okay? And I got myself La Tulip. Ang bango nito, it's like a bouquet of flowers. I'm actually looking for um, a more feminine, floral-ish fragrance. So, that's what's in my head. And yung Baldia Free kasi, it's very um, genderless and fresh, woody. Basta very, may pagka-eccentric yung ano, floral niya. And perfect siya kapag um, on my very casual, androgynous days. Pero yung pag mga naka-dress, I'm going to a garden wedding, or yung mga, mga dress type of events, or if I'm wearing a dress, or anything feminine, perfect tong latulip. I only got the small one kasi yun nga, medyo umurong yung chan ko. Umurong yung chan ko. <laughs> kasi, 
I own Kasi this is 50 ml and beshi this is 11,000. Okay, the big one is uh, 15,000. But looking back, I did not buy the big one because as I said, I was expecting that I buy something else pa. Magkakatabi kasi yun eh, by Redo, Lilabo, my son uh, 21G. So I was thinking I would buy something from those brands. So that's why I'm on I only got this. Pero wala akong nagustuhan masyado sa Lilabo. So I don't know, but di ko binalikan yung Bayredo. Ay, kasi parang pagod na ba ako nun. And I, ah, parang tinawag na ako sa Chanel. So, I had to run. My God, 11,000! Bye! Ang mahal. <laughs> Gosh, ang bango, grabe. Sobrang unique talaga. So, itong mga niche fragrance na to, um, yung mga high-end fragrance, ando na ako sa high-end niche fragrances eh. Itong Bayredo, Parang siya na yung favorite ko ngayon. Kasi nakadalawa na ako eh. And, and it takes a lot of me to spend that much for beauty product and a perfume. So, pag nag-spend na ako ng ganun, ibig sabihin, love na love ko na siya. Tapos, binigyan niya ako ng dalawang libre. Kasi sabi ko, napapanguhan ako sa Sundays and sa Rose Noir. And then, sabi niya, okay, I'll give you um, samples so that you can try. Alright, so that's it for Bayredo. Next is... From Apple! Grabe yung Apple stores doon ang lalaki. Tapos hindi na ubusan ng tao. Yung tipong kapag ano, pumasok ka tapos nadamihan kang tao o malis ka, parang di ka kawalan. <laughs> Ganun doon. Ang daming tao! And I love their their um, store concept. Parang it's borderless. Parang big tables lang siya and everyone can just come in and then talk about the products, ask people and ask the, the staff about the products. Tapos ang gusto ko doon, you di ba meron silang display counter of the gadget. So you try it there and you pay na rin there. So hindi ka na nililipat. Marvelous. Sana um, here in the Philippines, they do that store concept also. That's very time saving. Yung doon na lahat. Then go ka na. Tapos na. So sa Apple, ang binili ko, dalawa lang. And it's for my cell phone. Ito talaga. Ito yung gusto kong bilhin. This is the MagSafe battery pack. And, para, ano lang, charger lang ng iPhone ko. Yun ang gusto ko. For some reason, hindi ko alam na nag-update. Parang ang bilis na madrain ng battery ng iPhone. Hindi ko alam. My God, Apple, ba't ka ganyan? Ang mahal-mahal ng gadgets mo. Tapos, ginaganon mo kami. Anyway, ito siya. Of course, for that to cling onto the cell phone, you take out the, the casing and then you put it on. But that exposes your phone to, um potential damage. So, that's why you need a case that can accommodate a power pack. So, syempre, napabili din ng lola nyo na. Dalawa sila. Magkano ba yung pinahit ko rito? 89 plus 139. So, it's like 219 plus dollars. Spend about 8,000 for these two. My God. Kasi mga nasa 5K na to. To around uh, nearly 3,000. Next natin is Sephora. Uh, I'm sure hinihintay. Ay, hindi. Next natin is ito si Dior. I had three beauty brands in mind to to shop from and um, get in Singapore. And these are Char Charlotte Tilbury, Dior, and Pat McGrath. However, sold out to Charlotte Tilbury and si Pat McGrath. As in, zero. Walang, wala yung mga bestsellers. So, wala yung binili sa Charlotte Tilbury. And that's why I just focused on Dior. So, sa Dior, ito ata yung bestseller. This is the Lip Glow Lip Oil. Now, in Sephora, it's out of stock. Yung available lang is yung colorless. I almost got that, but good thing I realized, okay, maybe I should check the other Dior stores. And, ayun, madami. So, meron pang Dior na standalone store sa, sa Takashimaya, sa Ngian City. And there's also one inside um, Takashimaya Department Store. So, kung out of stock sa Sephora, don't settle for um, whatever's there. And go instead to the department store sa Takashimaya or to the Dior boutique sa ground floor. Alright, next, I got from Chanel dahil meron akong Chanel, so might as well buy another Chanel. I am looking for a nighttime fragrance kasi nahanap ko na yung um, daytime HG daytime fragrance ko. And that is by Redo Baldia Freak. And then the second one is La Tulip, which I just got recently. For the last one, I was thinking of um, Frederick Mal or something from Lilabo or my, my son 21G. But at the end of the day, I realized ko Chanel talaga. Kasi dumaan ako sa counter ng Takashimayas na amoy ko yung perfume na to. And sabi ko, okay, ito talaga yung gusto ko. And it's Tadaan! Coco Mad! So, this is Coco Mademoiselle. The first time I smelled this, sobrang nabangohan talaga ako. And sabi ko, this is how I envisioned Chanel number no. 5 would be for younger girls. 
So, ito si Coco Mademoiselle. Kasi, it is, um, it's a pretty heavy rose, but it mellows down into like a more floral, powdery scent. Still with, um, with rose. Generally, rose pa rin siya. Pero hindi matapang and hindi amoy masyadong, ano, motherly yung scent. Kasi ganun talaga si N5 for me. Pero this one, ayun, ang bango niya. And pwedeng pang day, pwedeng pang night. So, sabi ko nga, kailangan ko ng night fragrance talaga. Eh, ayaw ko naman ipilit dun sa mga Lilabo by Redo. Ang mahal nila para ipilit ko. Then, I realized na maybe I should go for what my heart really likes. And it's really Coco Mademoiselle. And binigyan ako ng dalawang libreng perfume. So, it's Coco Mademoiselle. Oh, binigyan ako yung Eau de Parfum and Chanel Chance. Ito yung gusto ko bilhin eh, pero na-realize ko, okay, basta gusto ko talaga si Coco Mad. Last but not the least na fragrance, na um, makeup is Sephora. As I mentioned, wala akong masyadong binili dito mga besh. Uy, may nasingit. I love Singapore magnet. Ang hilig ko talaga sa mga magnet. Okay, so sa Sephora, as I mentioned, I didn't buy a lot because wala akong masyadong trip. So, yun. Ang binili ko sa Dior is this one. Dior Forever Foundation. <laughs> Meron ako nakuhang huling shade. Buti naman. And it is... This is the matte foundation. Meron kasi silang bagong uh, Dior Skin. Yun, yun. Pero ito ata yung maganda. Yung uh, matte. So, try natin yan. Perfect para sa um, panahon ngayon. Anyway, next is this one. So, this is the Pat McGrath Skin Fetish Sublime Perfection Concealer. So, I got the last shade. Yung last shade niya is L11. Actually, parang medyo maputi mga shades ni ano, Pat McGrath. Ito na yung darkest, ha? Tapos, parang ma maputi pa rin siya sa akin. And this is Rare Beauty Soft Pinch Liquid Blush. Ito actually nire-rave sa TikTok. And bumili lang ako nung shade na Love. Ito na lang din yung natirang shade. But good thing, type ko yung shade. Para siyang um, orange, ganun. So, ayan! And I have um, my last two hauls over there. Dalhin ko lang dito. Okay, so dito tayo sa heat. This is my second to the last haul. And this is, um, ang tawag sa kanya, streetwear brand. So, kung gusto nyo yung mga Yeezy, Fear of God, um, Nike shoes, and Adidas shoes na yung hard to find, and also New Balance, dun kayo pupunta. Actually, um, hindi ko talaga bibilin to. Parang sabi ko, I, I, I'm only choosing between a Chanel pair flats or a pair of Nike shoes na Air Jordans. If I find either one of those, then I will get either one of those. Pero my heart was really sad on a Chanel, pair of Chanel flats. However, walang available ng gusto kong color, yung beige and black. I want something neutral that can go with anything. Um, yung mga shades lang doon ng shoes are red, pink. Hindi siya practical for me kasi I'm a one and done kind of girl. So parang pag bumili ako ng isang pair dito, yun na yun, tapos na ako. Anyway, instead of um, Air Jordan, parang ito yung natipan ko. And actually, kala ko Air Jordan ko, pero hindi pala. And this is the... Tcharan! Dunk Low Shoes in Heat. Ang ganda niya, beige. Diba? Black and white. Actually, magaganda yung mga beige, um, royal blue. Pero I'm a black and white kind of girl talaga. And I've seen this on some girls na naglalakad doon sa Singapore. Ang ganda niya tingnan, actually. So, ang mahal nito, ah. Mga na, magkano to? Nasa $380. So, that's about mga 15 k So, yun. Mahal siya, beige. So, yan. Kung gusto niyo yung mga ganito, um, na na types of shoes, yung mga streetwear, high-end streetwear din yun. Punta kayo sa Heat. They are located at Midpoint Orchard. And that is along Orchard Road. However, yun, hindi lang sila nag-offer ng tax refund. Okay? And last but not the least, tcharan! Ito na ang aking gift for myself. And ano ba ito? Ano ba itong binili ko, Be? So, pakita ko lang. May binigay sila sa akin na catalog. May TAs the art. So, this is their latest collection. Buong ganong catalog, ah, parang libro, ah. Parang part ata yun ang binayaran ko. Charot. Okay, so ano tong binili ko? Tadam! And, Beshi, sorry, pero ikakad ko na dito kasi wala na rin akong battery. And para at least meron pa kayong susundan. So, thanks for joining me in this single haul unboxing. And I hope you enjoy these. And kung may questions kayo about the products I bought and the stores I mentioned, please just comment below. And in the next video, i-unbox natin itong birthday gift slash Christmas gift for myself. Sana talaga, no, pang Christmas na to. And Marta, mm, kilala kita, kilala kita. Christmas gift ka dyan. Pero okay.
tama na Christmas gift na talaga. Ayan. So, I'll see you in the next video. So, thanks for watching. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't um, subscribed to me yet. Follow my social media accounts. Visit my blog. And I'll see you in the next video. And follow me on TikTok as well. All my social media handles and blog are in the description box. So, thanks for watching, Bashi. And bye-bye! Thank you.